Hey, so hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a really, really exciting video and it's quite different for me actually. I'm going to be doing a my luxury wish list, so like my so things that I like designer, like Chanel, Gucci, stuff like that, my like wish list for that. Disclaimer. Um, what's my disclaimer? My disclaimer is, obviously I'm not trying to show off, like, obviously I'm not showing off. This is just like things that I probably am never going to get. Well, maybe not if I save up for them, but it's most of these things are like unrealistically priced but it's just if i did have this money this is my wish list and if i ever did cat could be able to afford maybe one of these things i think I, I could i mean i could afford a few of these things now but i just wouldn't i want to save for like something really big and anyway let's just get started also i hope you're loving my little pink vibe today i've got my disneyland top on i've got um some calvin klein socks yeah some um primark pajama bottoms Links be down below, I'm joking. Yeah, my top is from Disneyland and it's age 10 and it's extremely small and tight and it's, it's too tight. And my jacket is from Misguided. I feel very cute. And also my makeup, oh my god. So my makeup, Huda Beauty, Desert Dusk Palette and... Bye. And my Magic Palette by Juvia's Place. My lips are Too Faced in shade Cool Girl and Huda Beauty Lip Strobe in shade Mystical on top of it. Anyway, let's just get started, even though I said that a minute ago. First, there's not going to be any... Oh, I'm going to start with shoes first. So the first shoes I have are the Chanel Fashion Ankle Boots by Chanel. Yeah, they're the ankle boots, and they are lambskin. So first of all, that's one sign. Anything that's made of lambskin, I just can't. Like, lambs are cute. No. Anyway, they're £950, and they are have got a 5 point... No, a 3.5 inch heel and they're just honestly so gorgeous i love like i cannot wear thin heels but the i just love boots boots are all i wear like i never wear trainers i'm a boots kind of girl okay and i just love like the you know like the quilt bit on the heel it's like it's they just look expensive the little chanel sign on the zip is just really cute oh by the way i'm using my dad's phone because i film with my other phone also i'm touching my hair a lot today because it's really ugly and i've just washed it so please ignore that and I just I think they're beautiful to be quite honest with you. So yeah. Next of all, I actually have another pair of shoes from Chanel. They are the Espadrilles. I think that's how you say it. these are five hundred and seventy. And I just think there's just you could wear these like with anything like with jeans. I'll look cute. These are actually the tanned colours. Are they beige or tan colours? I don't know. But they are beautiful. Oh, they ivory and black. So the colours ivory, but they've got like the black Chanel sign on them. And they just be perfect for like a holiday in like a hot country. Yeah, how are they lambskin? They don't look like lambskin, they look like... Oh, apparently they are. Okay. And then next I actually have the small ankle boots from Louis Vuitton. These are just these silhouette ankle boots and they have just like the Louis Vuitton pattern all over them. And I know it's a bit in your face, but if I bought something from Louis Vuitton, that is... Wait for it. That is £750. I want people to know I bought from Louis Vuitton, not from a pound shop. Okay. Yeah, they just have like the plain black heel. And I just think the colours are so gorgeous and they're just brown and they're cute. And then I also from Louis Vuitton, I have the front row sneakers. And these are 445 And they have the Louis Vuitton sign all over them as well. And the little gold Louis Vuitton and the, like, the little tiny white platform at the bottom of the shoe. And I never really wear trainers, but these aren't like trainer trainers, are they? They're like cute they're like cute trainers they're like fashionable trainers do you know do you get me am i am i getting me am i getting me i don't know i don't know i just don't know okay let's just carry on because i'm being annoying and i also have the gucci leather sandal sandals and they're just the plain black ones the only thing i wouldn't buy these really because my toes, when I see my toes, my toes, my toes are disgusting. Like I know everyone's like, oh my god, my feet are disgusting. My toes are disgusting. My feet are fine. Toes, no. My toes are just weird. Also, I have a really big, big toe. So it just wouldn't look right. But other than that, they're gorgeous. They have the little, like, GG sign on the, um, the toe cover-up. What do you call it? The bit that, the bit that goes over the toe. My, you, do you know what I'm saying? Do you get what I'm saying? Because I get what I'm saying. They're just the black ones. And they are, did I say the price? Did I, I didn't say the price. If it loads, I will say the price, hang on. They are £540 and, oh my god, they're gorgeous. 
and the hill height is actually 105 millimeters and it has an adjustable strap well i would have hoped so i get an adjustable strap in new look i would want one in gucci yeah that is all the shoe oh no and i have some the gucci original ace leather sneakers trainers whatever you want to call them these are so gorgeous i love like the little b are they bees i don't know if they're bees or not but they're cute and these are 440 yeah they're just sneakers and they have a rubber sole they're white leather with green and red web gross gain side detail with a gold bee embroidery the black is designed to be worn with the heel folded down or up is it oh well well they're cute and i love them and i want them and they don't look too in your face gucci but like you can see they're gucci like you look at them and think gucci but you don't think gucci 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 sorry about that i've actually had to put a bun in my hair because i realized how crap i looked hey my dad's leaving goodbye my friend goodbye I'm gonna carry on. Oh my god, have I got a bit sticking out? I don't even care. I'm sorry. If I if I was watching a video of someone's hair sticking out, I'd be like, I have to click off. So please don't click off. I hope you're enjoying it. Okay, so now I'm actually going going to go on to bags. Oh by the way, if you want a part two, because I've got loads more things like on my wish list, but this video will be way too long. And if you can't tell, I'm trying to make my videos a bit shorter because my videos, if you just scroll through, you notice that in the past my videos are usually 16 minutes or over and people just don't want to watch me for that long comment down below if you'd rather have me talk for 16 minutes or for 8 minutes because I can do both kind of not this video is definitely not going to be 8 minutes this video is going to be longer yeah yeah okay okay next I'm actually going to do bags like I said a million times first of all I have um let's start with let's start with what we ended with Gucci so I actually have the G, you're going to all call me basic, but I don't care, I love this bag so much. It's the the GG Mom, the mini, Mo, the small Marmot Maltese bag, and I honestly, okay, when I was really, not young, but like when this bag first came out, so I was, I was, was it like two years ago? And it wasn't like a big thing then, like the Maltese Marmot wasn't like a big thing. I was obsessed with this bag. I was like, you know what, I'm saving for it. Didn't save for it because it's £885. And I just couldn't save for it. I was like, you know what, no. I loved it before it got big. Now everyone has it. And I don't think if I wanted a bag, this wouldn't be my first one I'll get. Only because I want to be different. I don't want to have the same bag as everyone else. But other than that, it's beautiful. And it's just black. And I love the G on it. Like I said, it's not too in your face Gucci. Like it hasn't got the Gucci print all over it. But I love it. I love it so much. And also like the... The um the colour um the other colour, the pinkish colour. Is that what's called pinky purple? Yeah, that's cute as well. Then I actually have the another Gucci one. It's the Gucci Soho small leather disco bag. This is 805. Now I think I like this bag better than the minimal tees now. Because actually yeah, everyone has this one as well, but I just love it. It's so simple, yet practical. And I like the tassel, the tassel just is like hello i love it and then i actually have a backpack now oh my god i love this bag but i just wouldn't buy it because backpacks don't work for me i'm more of a handbag kind of girl like you don't see me walking around in this jacket with a backpack on my back do you it's more like handbag handbag yeah it's the is it louis vuitton i thought it was ysl i'm actually right yeah it's the lock me backpack mini by louis vuitton it's 1640 and it just has like really nice thin straps and they're not too thick and it's just black and like I said it's not too in your face Louis Vuitton because they have a lot of things that have their prints all over and do you know what my worst nightmare would be to have a bag that just says Louis Vuitton all over it I don't mind shoes and stuff like that but I just wouldn't but this is just so beautiful I love the hardware on it and it looks like it could fit a lot in you know oh no what leather is, is it leather I just feel oh god when they put it like do you know what I just I don't know if I could like, I'm not vegan or vegetarian, but I don't know the fact that there's just that bag is made out of calf skin. I just couldn't. But let's pretend it's made out of not calf skin. Let's pretend it's fake calf skin for now. Yeah, it's a really nice bag. And it comes with mustard. No, no gold. I don't know the gold one. It looks tacky. Black all the way. Okay. And then I actually have my absolute dream, dream bag. This is like a big dream if I ever got this. Honestly, I'm just going to be so happy. This is a bag that I'm going to be saving for a couple of years. Do you know what? 
yeah, it's gonna take me a couple of years to save this. I don't think I will save for it. I probably won't ever be able to get a bag like this, but it's a Chanel bag, and you'll probably be thinking, oh, classic boy bag, flat bag. No, no. I want the most intricate designed one ever. It is, oh, it's a boy bag, but no, but it's not a classic boy bag. It is, wait for it, wait for it to load. Hang on, hang on, wait for it to load. It is the, oh, for God's sake, it's not working now. Oh no, it's running out of battery. Please, I've got a few more things left. Don't do it to me, Chanel, don't do it. Please. Oh my God, I'm so embarrassed. I just realised I had a, um, a bit of hair sticking out the whole time. Oh my God, that's really annoying, isn't it? Let's just sit out, okay? Nice and okay. Anyway, the Chanel bag is my absolute dream bag, like I've said a million times. It's been a while. It hasn't been a while, it's been two seconds. It is the... Are you ready for it? Are you ready for it? Mmm, mmm, mmm. Oh, guess I was a killer for some that aside. Oh my god, I saw that live. It's great, great, great. Go watch my vlog. It was my vlogmas day. It was quite into the days by then. Okay, this is the Boy Chanel handbag and it is the braided tweed calf skin and gold tone metal beige and pink bag do you know what if you know me you know i love tweed i'm a sucker for tweed and boot clay stuff like that oh my god this is just the most gorgeous bag ever and the thing is i don't know if i could buy it because it's one of them bags it's just would it go with everything like pink on pink i wear a bit of pink now pink on pink but it will go with my boot clay suit so so much but it's four thousand pound. Well, it's four thousand five hundred and thirty pound, and this is a bag. I don't know if this is the kind of bag that holds its value as it gets older, or that even gets more worth more money as it gets older. It's not one of them, but it's just it's so 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 beautiful. It's just this bag is unreal. It's unreal. Okay, moving on. Now I have wallets and purses and stuff like that. Card holders. That's the one, isn't it? Card holders slash purses. Okay, I don't actually have many. I have a lot more in part two. If you want part two, comment down below. First of all, I'm gonna start with my, the YSL monogram credit card case in black grain Depodra de textured Maltese leather. This is so, so gorgeous. Okay, I prefer most of the time silver hardware on stuff only because I just think silver looks more expensive. It's not stupid because you'd think gold, but I sometimes just think gold can look tacky, but I do love gold as well. The silver I just love. And I want the black one because I know it just, the black one looks more classy, but then I really, 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 really want the pale blush one because I just love pink. I love pink. I love pink, as you can see. Look, pink nails, pink jacket, pink top. I love pink so much, but I just know that I would go off of it as I get older, and if it was black, I could keep it. And you know what? This is actually a really good price for YSL. It is, um, it's you've sent the wrong, by the way. It is 150, and I might buy this when I go to New York because I just love it, and it would be my, like my first proper proper done item. It'd just be great. Anyway, I also have a Louis Vuitton card holder, and it's just got the classic print on the front. Um, and the red, it's like red inside, like dark red. And I think it's beautiful. This is £130 and I just love to have it. Okay, and lastly for the wallet section, I have a Boy Chanel card holder. This is 380 and oh my God, it's pink as well. I just imagine my pink nails, pink jacket, my pink tweed bag from Chanel, my pink wallet. It's got a bit of gold hardware, but not too much gold stuff on it. But it's beautiful and the, like it's just it's the perfect size. Well, I don't actually know what well, it is the perfect size because I measured it against something because I wanted to know my things. And it's just beautiful and a lot of pink. Pink is cute. Pink is great. Well, I'm making a song about pink. I don't know. Okay, and lastly, we're going to be going into the category of other. No, this is like accessories. Okay. So first of all, I have. Well, I've wanted this. Oh my god, since. I was about 11. I've always been in stuff like this, but obviously I couldn't, but it's the Giant Check Cashmere Scarf by Burberry. Oh my God, this is 350 and I've, I have just want this cashmere scarf. It's so soft. I've, you do not know how many times I've touched this Burberry scarf I thought I need this, but I don't want to spend 350 pound on a scarf. Like, I just can't afford it. It's just beautiful. I honestly love it. It's, 
the colours on it, it just would go like with this pink jacket. It would go with everything. It would go with everything and more. I don't want my initials on it because that's cute. Okay, and I actually have the Gucci belt. Classic, I know. It's the the double G, the gold, and it's just a black one. And I think this is so cute, but I don't know if it would be practical for me because I don't really wear many things it would go with. And it's 320 but other than that, I think it's beautiful and I really, really love it. And then lastly, I have a Gucci top. No, I'm not including that. Well, there won't be an overlay picture, but I'll show you one here. It's the classic Gucci top. Yeah, I love that as well, but it's not like I didn't get a picture for it because I was thinking, of, yeah, anyway. I also, for this video, I use Shop Tagger to get all my things. And Shop Tagger is, I'm not sponsored, obviously. Who would want to sponsor someone with 350 subscribers? No one. <laughs> But um, I'll just tell you what it is. It's really good. I don't use it for the fact of things that go on sale because I just use it for like things like my wish list things. I use it for that kind of stuff because then you can keep it all together in one wish list. And I just think it's great, really. Anyway, I really, really, really hope you enjoyed this video. If you want more videos like this, please, please comment down below. And I love you all so, so, so much. Bye. I got my lipstick on my hand.